looking back, I was always interested in, if you see something complicated, what are its little parts and how do they work and how do you understand it? And uh, eventually, I just came to the point that nothing, nothing cannot be understood. Whatever it is, you can always eventually find what its parts are and how they work and how this new phenomenon uh, that you wouldn't believe could come out of those parts can. And that's science and uh, that's computer science especially because computer science changed everything. Before 1950, you couldn't make a theory of how the brain worked because you didn't know how to describe that sort of complicated process. Mathematics was good for some things, but mathematics is peculiar. It's no good for describing a system that has a lot of ifs in it. If this happens, then do that. If this happens, do that. Mathematics breaks, generally, when you've got a lot of those, but the real world is full of them. So computer science is not just about computers, it's about how to think about complicated processes.